I'm Disney artist and historian Stacia Martin, and I'm thrilled to be here celebrating the golden anniversary of Walt Disney World, 50 magical years. You know, Walt Disney World has often been called a wonderland, so perhaps it's appropriate that we invite a character from Walt Disney's Alice in Wonderland to the big 50th anniversary party. This is a character that a lot of people love, and it's funny because a lot of people ask me, well, is the Cheshire Cat a villain? Or is he a friend to Alice as she journeys through Wonderland? And you know, that's still an object of debate because the Cheshire Cat tries to be helpful in his way, but as a song that was written for the film but ultimately cut, it can be found on some of our Disney's Lost Chords recordings. But the song says, I'm odd. That was the Cheshire Cat's kind of anthem. And I wouldn't argue with that. He is certainly odd. He's helping Alice, but he's also amusing himself by kind of toying with her and leading her astray. However, it leads her to new adventures too as she wanders through the Tulji Wood. So he's odd, but he's also interested in having a little bit of fun. Now, if you go back to the original Alice in Wonderland books by Lewis Carroll, and I say books because there are two, there's not only Alice in Wonderland, but there's also Alice's Adventures in the Looking Glass. And those characters are all very different one from another. Walt and his original team of artists spent many years trying to adapt the two Lewis Carroll Alice books for the screen. He was even working on it back in the 1930s before the World War II years. But finally, the Alice in Wonderland stories were condensed down into one cohesive storyline of adventures, and it incorporated characters from both Alice in Wonderland, the book, and Alice Through the Looking Glass. And I guess that kind of accounts for the way that he doesn't do anything in a straightforward manner. He can't even be helpful to Alice straight away because I don't think he really knows how to behave in a normal, straightforward way himself. Everything he does is brillig, and even the Slithy Toves and the Momraths would have to agree. But one thing we know about the Cheshire Cat for sure, this big smile you see on his face, that's because he is a huge part of the Walt Disney World Golden Anniversary. In fact, it's funny, Walt Disney World opened 50 years ago this year, and Walt Disney's Alice in Wonderland, the motion picture, premiered 70 years ago this year. So they both have a big anniversary at the same time. So we'll wish them both a wonderful happy birthday, or in the spirit of Wonderland, a very merry un-birthday. And what would a celebration be, at least a Disney celebration, without some pixie dust? There we go, a big smile from the Cheshire Cat and a little magical pixie dust to see us into our next golden half decade.